What's up, everybody? King of FOMO here, coming at you with your daily crypto update. Make sure you follow me over there on Telegram. That's T. Me says King of FOMO one, as well as my TikTok channel listed right there on the screen. So we're gonna be talking about the meme coins of the week, Dogecoin and the other dog coins. Where are they going to go? Uh, where can they go from here? I'm gonna give you guys my take. Uh, my take is pretty different than everybody else's take. Everybody has their own viewpoint. At the end of the day, you really need to figure this out for yourself as far as your position and what you're gonna do with these dog coins. So amalgamate everybody's takes and make your own decision. But nonetheless, let's talk about Dogecoin as well as the others. We're going to get into Akita, Shiba Pup, which is a brand new one, Shiba Inu, the Shizu token, which I talked about not too long ago, and many, many more. So if you guys don't know, Dogecoin has been all, all about what's like, this has been the focus of crypto for the past couple weeks. Uh, it's been uh, anticipated that an event yesterday, Saturday Night Live, Elon Musk's appearance, he would mention Dogecoin and that would go up to a dollar. Now, us veterans in crypto kind of knew that wasn't going to happen. Whenever you have big time hype and then a big news point uh, and that there's nothing really after that news point, generally what happens is you have a pretty big dump immediately after that news point, which is exactly what happened. No surprise there. Uh, I do think that Dogecoin will rebound and go back to a dollar eventually. Um, so no panic there. But beyond that, I don't, I don't really see you know that much more hope for ten dollar Dogecoin or anything like that. Uh, but um, you know that's generally what happens with crypto. So we'll talk more about that in a little bit. I do want to talk about some of the other meme coins. So these are other dog coins that have sort of taken Dogecoin's thunder. And I think a lot of the reason for that is because a lot of the people that originally bought Dogecoin started to learn a little bit more about how crypto works they started to understand that there's these other tokens that exist on the ethereum blockchain and how to buy them uh so they're starting starting over why not try again with some of these lower market cap coins maybe they can do the same thing as those coins i mean we can see here today this is one that launched earlier today called shiba pup uh up one one thousand one hundred and forty seven percent that's about 20x or maybe 10x from where it first started which is pretty insane uh, for a coin that just launched today with $29 million of volume and continuing to rise. So again, you're having a lot of these people that are brand new to pump and dumps, brand new to this hype stuff. Uh, so uh, I do think that the, these dog coins have potential to keep going up over time. I do think that eventually it'll fade out and these uh, this, this is a whole positive about everything. I've been talking about this for a while with Dogecoin. I think the, the end game for Dogecoin is that you've introduced a lot of new people to crypto. Uh, I don't think that these dog coins are going to be the staple of crypto, but it, it is a really good introduction point to see uh, how um, you can earn a lot from here. And the markets are unregulated at the moment, which is not necessarily a bad thing. So Shiba Pup up a ton. And even like coins that I've talked about here on this channel, like I, I kind of predicted that something like this would happen. I bought for Shizu over here, I bought two Ethereum worth of Shizu uh, back when it first launched, and that was about uh, about four thousand dollars. Ethereum was about two thousand dollars at the time. This was on April twenty uh, third, I think, when I made this video. Yeah, April twenty third, so a few weeks ago. And um, yeah, from there, I bought two Ethereum worth of this Shizu token. Right now, if I were to sell my Shizu token uh, right now, I'd get about forty four thousand uh, dollars. So turning two thousand dollars into forty four thousand dollars is pretty insane. I believe I'm a top fifty top 60 holder. Uh, now I'm not going to sell my Shizu tokens just because uh, I'm kind of just holding it for the memes. I don't really need the 44k, even though it's a really, really nice amount, uh, you know, dropping that price 14% or, or um, dropping that price, whatever the amount is, is not something that I'm <laughs> planning on doing right now. I do think that, like I said, these dog coins, they're not done yet. Uh, but uh, of course, I do think they do have a cap. They have a top. They have a limit. Uh, they're not safe holds for long term. They are very, very high risk and, and you know, vulnerable to major swings that will never come back. So do, you know, keep that in mind. But at the same time, I don't think that it is done yet. A lot of times, uh, you, like whatever people expect something to happen, it just doesn't go that way. That's, that's what I noticed in crypto. And people expected um, there to be a giant pump for SNL and uh, it didn't happen. Pretty much the exact opposite happened. So now people are expecting these dog coins to completely die out because they dumped and everyone's gonna be scared off into the distance and nobody's gonna come to crypto again. But uh, you know, honestly, I don't think that's gonna happen. I don't think these dog coins are done yet. I think they're going to rise up for a little bit longer and then eventually they'll kind of slowly die off over time. 
as people get interested in other more serious projects. But nonetheless, I mean, there's a lot to check out. Uh, just taking a look at Sheets, you just because I'm, I'm a little more, um, you know, researched on this one. This one has a market cap currently, I think, of about $30 million. And if we compare that to coins like Akita or even like Shiba Pup, uh, these are coins with uh, similar market caps. And I think that Shiba, if, if you're, if, or Sheet Zoo, if you're just looking at, you know, how high the, can these coins go, honestly, really the sky is the limit especially with these low market cap coins like you you can't underestimate the power of normal people trying out something new there are tons and tons of people that didn't know a dang thing about crypto that jumped into dogecoin and i think that a ton of those people are going to be looking at these meme coins and trying them out as well so as the second one of them gets traction in, and it can be any one of them it can be shitsu it can be shiba it can be shiba pup continuing to go up multiple thousand percentage per day akita uh, i don't know like dogecoin i think it's it's had its run so it's not going to really have anything super crazy happen from here on out uh but I think the main reason is because a lot of the Dogecoin runners, they're gonna, they're, they've seen the potential of lower market cap coins, and they're they're good enough at math to know uh, kind of what the better choice is if you want a quick two x or something like that. Um, but yeah, the sky is the limit when it comes to these these lower market cap coins. So like, I can't even give you a price prediction at all um, because you know you could see a ten x like like today with shiba like nobody could have predicted shiba pup to 10x in 24 hours and it going beyond here can it 10x again can it go up to 100x yes i think very much so it can of course you, you should always do a little bit of math if you're really looking to hold these things long term and be a little serious with them as far as putting them in the top 100 or beyond but honestly it's unpredictable. Like, like if TikTok or if Elon Musk or, or if just the general public, um, you know, latch on to a particular altcoin, you know, that's 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 it. It's done. It's going to really just take off. And, um, you know, <laughs> then on now you just have to analyze it day by day. So take a look at all of them. Honestly, you guys can make your own decision up. Uh, I told you guys about Shih Tzu as early as I could. And, you know, they're what was that? I feel like a 20x for me for from that. Um, so we'll see what happens. I'm going to continue to hold my dog tokens because, uh, yeah, like I said, these things are going to swing a lot. You're going to have some upward movement. You're going to have some downward movement. But I think that the movement total movement upward is not done yet which is one of the reasons why i'm holding these coins and if you are holding doge like like i said don't panic and freak out especially if you bought like near 70 cents or anything like that because i think a dollar is inevitable and that the, the main reason why i'm saying that is just because the like the total market cap for crypto two trillion dollars 2.5 trillion dollars i think that that's going to continue to rise over the next couple of weeks and months and um as as bitcoin goes higher all these other coins have a much much higher bar to reach um, so i think it's going to be easier for them to catch those crazy crazy high market caps like where dogecoin is with the 72 billion dollars i think that a lot of these other coins can get uh close to up there um but yeah there, there's a lot of other market analysis we can do about that that's, that would be about crypto and as a whole and how that's kind of taking over but I'll save that for another video. We can talk about that another time. That is everything for today, guys. Check out these coins on your own. Uh, maybe I'll leave some links to some of them, but you can kind of just type this in CoinGecko or CoinMarketCap. We have Akita. We have uh, Shiba Inu. We have Shitzu. You have the Shiba Pup token. All these coins, you guys can look at these on your own and, and do your own research as far as what you want to buy. Uh, and we'll see what happens. Let's see, uh, you know, m honestly, my my goal, my price point for Shitzu. If, since we're talking about this, since I'm one of the top holders in here is probably double the price of where it is right now. So if I could get 100K out of my 2K, I think that, that would be a pretty good sell point. Of course, I, I don't know if I'm going to dump it all at once, but you know, we'll see what happens. Anyway, that is everything for today, guys. I'll catch you in the next video. Like, comment, subscribe. Peace out.